What is up, YouTube? My name's Lack the Eddie. Welcome back to Stardew Valley. And it's been a while again. <laughs> uh, I might have an idea on how to get back on track and get these posted regularly again. But this week is not going to be that week, unfortunately. So I'm going to do my best to pack as much into this episode as I can. Oh, our kid's standing up now. Oh, just launched our kid into the air. That's fine. Um, <laughs> um, I'm going to try and put as much into this episode as I can, but it's, again, probably only going to be a couple days worth since I am now like 10 days removed from last time I played this. Maybe two weeks removed since last I played. I got to get back into playing this more. So we have nothing in the journal. We have no crops. We have no truffles. Welcome back to winter. So there's something specific that I want to do. I spent a while on the farm already. Almost three hours. I don't want to tell you guys what it is yet. Because I need to collect some things for it first. But I have a goal in mind. Do I ever do my goals? No. But, you know, I'm going to try this time. Sebastian. Sebastian, here's a gift. Thank you for coming out of your house. I appreciate you. Here, let me talk to you too. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Oh, now get out of my way. Thank you. All right, our adventure is going to start on Ginger Island, where I'm going to need to hunt down Leo and get him up. Oh, oh. I see him. Leo, don't run from me. Don't long run from my love. Yeah. Now, 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 now talk to me. Perfect. Great. All right, I'll see you later. Ooh, oh. A Leo cutscene? I only have two hearts with him. I'll take it. What are you doing, Locke? Hmm, pondering the big questions. Just enjoying the waves. Just enjoying the waves. Waves. The other birds say the reason Leo can't fly is because Leo spent too much time in the waves long ago. My wing's full of water now. Yeah, I'm... Oh, I have questions. Lock? Tell me about the place you come from. Your home. There's forest, beaches, and mountains. It's like here, but colder. I live on a farm. There's a town full of people. Forest, beaches, and mountains. I feel like he would want to know about the forest, the beaches, and the mountains. Sounds nice. Are, are there other kids? Yes. I, I know I'm not actually a bird, lock. I'm like you. But I don't like thinking about it. Oh, because I'm so alone. It's gonna make me cry. With my bird family, I feel like I belong. But I don't belong. I don't belong anywhere. I'm so sad. I'm so sad. Poor lad. Oh, that rhymed. Am I a little cattywampus here? I think I'm a little... A little off. I wonder if there's some way to help. Move him to... Move him to the valley. Move him to the valley. Oh, okay. No, we're just gonna let him be sad? Alright. Just kidding. Yeah. F Leo. Not actually. I feel really bad for him. We're gonna talk to Mr. Quee. See if we can get... Something. Some challenge going. I feel like most of these are gonna be tough in the winter. Find 100 each of red, orange, yellow, green, blue... Okay, that's the, the big one. Uh, make it to a level 100 in the Skull Cavern. This one I feel like I'm just gonna have to make stairs. So I'm just gonna need to put Jade in a Crystallarium and trade for as many stairs as possible. Or, get 100,000... Is it 100,000? Would it be 100,000? 100, 100 for one. I need 100 of them. 10,000? 10, 10,000 stone? Why does that seem more doable than that many jade? <laughs> Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and purple items. 
that's going to be exceptionally hard. Uh, that I'm going to have to Google and figure out what counts for what. 37%. We're getting there. Oh, it's so frustrating. We need more money. Um, tea leaves, produced and forage shipped. I've That one is upped. Perfect. And then all the rest of the things is like money related. Uh, except for the cooking and crafting. We could do cook, cooking and crafting. We could also go fishing. Are there winter fishing things to do? There's got to be, right? There's got to be. One of the things I need to do is I have to go to the volcano and get some shards. So we're going to do that first. All right, here we go. Oh, just right, right at the door for me? I mean, I'll take it. That's what I'm here for. <laughs> I didn't even make it in the door yet. You can definitely tell I was a little rusty in there. <laughs> but I think I got all that I need. And I got a recipe. So adding to the cooking list. Oh my god, I went the wrong way. Oh, we made it. Nice. Oh, it's Linus's birthday today. We got the night market, festival of ice, and feast of the winter star. Lots of lots of activities in the winter. I think they know that it's boring. We're gonna go find and talk to Leo. I can't give him any more gifts, because I've already gifted him twice this week, but we'll at least go talk to him. I'm going to assume that he's probably up here. Yeah, here he is. Okay, we are back over here to do what? I don't know yet. <laughs> we'll see. I think we're going to go for a legendary fish. Hey, Ken. Oh. I don't know who's cussing this is. Lock, you caught me. Caught you doing what? I was planning to ask Emily on a date. I was at her doorstep and everything, but then I heard her coming and I dove into this bush. Okay. Now I'm waiting until she's done talking with Caroline so I can sneak back into my house. Excuse me? What did you just say? You'll never upgrade your tools again if I don't ask her out? Yeah, that's what I said. You're a villain, Locke. Not true. Alright, I'll do it. I gotta remember that advice Locke gave me in the saloon. I don't remember what advice I gave him. I clicked through it too fast when I was in the saloon. Um, Emily? Sorry, Caroline. Could you excuse me for a minute? Okay, bye, Caroline. Yes, Clint? Come on, Clint, you can do it. I was wondering if you'd go with with t tomorrow, me. I got two tickets for the Grampleton Carnival tomorrow. W would you go with me? Sure, Clint, that sounds fun. See, Clint, that was not that bad. Really? Okay, I'll pick you up at five. Okay, see you tomorrow. Yes, see, Clint? Now he's all buzzing. <laughs> Did you see that? I got a date tomorrow. Alright, we're all excited. Caroline, you want to jump too? Oh man, I'm so nervous. <laughs> I feel you, Clint. I feel you. Alright, what are we doing? I actually came back this way to go to Clint. I believe. I think I have a gold mushroom. Golden mushroom. I got a golden mu coconut. Hey, Penny. I forgot about this. Ocean fish is growing to an unsustainable level. Cave patrol by Clint. Mm. 
The number of skeletons in the local caves have made mining dangerous for other people, not me. Good money for anyone willing to slay 50 of them. Or angler. Problem is, I don't know out of these what I've done so far. Because apparently I need to do these to get recipes. Hmm. I have the recipes from both of those, so I'm not going to do them. So to catch the glacier fish, we need to be on this tile. And we need our bobber to be at least a distance of four. It's like three or four tiles away from land. And I have a 50% chance of catching it. Those are pretty good odds. If I pull it up at the right time. No, I was so close. Ah! I'm going to see if I can get a food buff from Willy. It's the only other thing I can think of. Apparently the glacier fish is one of the hardest ones to catch. So, I don't know if we'll get it, but I'm going to keep trying. This might be the whole episode. I got some trout soup from Willy so we can get a slight fishing buff. And I also picked up a trap bobber just for mine breaks. Other than that, I think it's just going to take some doing. All right, here it goes. I didn't eat the soup. JK, just kidding. No way. I thought I was going to choke that. I got it. I got it. I can't believe I got it. No way. Now, what do I do with it? Sell it. Just kidding. <laughs> Holy shit. All right, well, now I have plans. Now I can do other things. I was going to say I have plans to do other things, but I only planned on doing one thing, and y'all haven't seen it yet. I'm about to go do it. But I. It, I'm speechless. <laughs> I need a chest just for legendary fish. I'll put it in here for now. Safekeeping. Actually, let's put it in the aquarium room. Put it right in the middle. There he is. Legendary fish. First one in the room. I have a thing for Gunther, but I don't know if he's going to be working. Like, I know that I can let myself into the museum after hours, but is he going to be there, is the question. Okay, he's here. I got this ring thing. Um, we're running out of spots over here. That'll work. So we can actually do a couple things. First thing I wanted to do is I'm hatching one of these. But first off, I got 3,000 things in my inventory. Hold on. So I really want an ostrich. There is no reason for it, but I want an ostrich. So we are going to put an incubator up there. I'm going to get an ostrich egg and come back. Like, I don't think there's a use for this. Like, all they're going to give me is more ostriches, I assume. But I want an ostrich. So there we go. We got an ostrich egg going. The other thing that we can now do is I have collected one of each wild fruit in the wintertime. So I can make a wild seed packet, which I haven't crafted one of these before. So, uh, yeah, I have. <laughs> Apparently ten of them. Why was that not there? <laughs> um, oh, I just now crafted ten of them. I'm stupid. Anyway, that will help us get tea leaves. Yes. So now I can get tea saplings. And I can get one more. Let's do that. Let me get some more wood. We have tea saplings. There we go. Now, where do I plant these at is the question. Final week of each season. No watering necessary. So, should I just set up an operation in this room? Should I just grow tea saplings in here? I don't really have any other plans for this room. 
I have some garden pots. I need one more. And I didn't craft these yet, so that adds to our list. I'm thinking these along this back wall. Wow, is the jukebox what plays my music every day? There's no music unless I have the jukebox out? I had no idea. I thought that was just the game music. I fell asleep before I could do what I wanted to do, but it's okay. Um, we have our pots out. Uh, I need to put my jukebox down. It's very awkwardly quiet. Oh, there's some game music. There we go. I feel like the mini fridge ruins the aesthetic of my room. Yeah, I don't like that. Oh, no. Oh, no, I'm breaking everything. Fixed it. Tea saplings. Tea saplings. Tea saplings before I break anything else. There we go. Now that'll be our little money-making machine over there. Ooh, we got another recipe. Nice, from Jody. Please come to Mary Lewis's house today to see what it's all about. Clothing therapy. So this is going to kind of be a funky episode. Um, I don't know where in the video this is going to fall. Um, but as you can tell, I changed. <laughs> I had recorded this over two sessions. I told you I've been having some rough time finding places to fit in recording. So yeah, I'm. this is a totally different day. I don't know where we're at. I quick resumed. So it's exactly where I paused before I left. I think I'm going to tackle some crafting things because I'm flipping through these and there's some easy ones like signs that I haven't made, cask looks really easy to make, stuff like that. So I might flip through this a little bit, gather some things, and try to try to make some of these. I've made 177 bombs. Huh, crazy. I think I'm going to try and focus on some of the easier stuff just to bust a lot out. I'm thinking maybe work from the bottom up. Just kidding, that has a radioactive bar in it, so that is not easy whatsoever. Hold on, let me get to the other things. Uh, like this one, bone fragment, stone, gold bar. Real easy. Clay, bone fragments, stone. So I think I'm going to try and work backwards. That way I can kind of keep track of what's going on and see what we have left. One thing I, we definitely need to do, I think Emily said to stop by, I think it was Mayor Lewis's or something. I don't remember exactly what it said. Mayor Lewis, where are you going? The saloon? At 11 a.m. on a Thursday? Oh, yeah, here we go. Uh, Abigail, why are you hanging out with Shane? Just, I just want to know. I just want to talk about it. <laughs> I didn't read that. I don't know what that said. You're probably wondering, what is clothing therapy? Oh, clothing therapy. That's what we're doing. My mic's really far away. I hope y'all can hear me. Uh, I'll try to explain. So many of us are struggling with personal issues, things holding us back from living how we want. It's important to me that everyone has a free and happy life, so I came up with a new kind of therapy to help people achieve that. Okay. It's based on the amazing power of self-expression. Self-expression is a wonderful healing tool. Did you know that? <laughs> Behind this curtain, you'll find racks and racks of clothes. There's endless options to choose from. Your job is simple. Find the outfit that truly speaks to you and put it on. Feel confident in yourself and your choice. You all have a unique style to share with the world. Shane, you're up first. <laughs> I don't think he wants to. Is he just going to come out wearing the same thing? Hey, there's me! Ah, uh, Locke, you're just in time. Just observe and keep an open mind, okay? I feel like he's going to come out just wearing the same thing. Oh! Okay. Punk Rock Shane. Got it. <laughs> Abigail, I think you're liking that a little bit too much. Shane, it's a new side of you we've never known about. That's great. Now, go outside with confidence and show the world. Sure. <laughs> okay, everyone. Oh, okay, everyone gets a turn. I'm kind of interested to see what everybody comes out like. I was not expecting Shane to look like that. Aww, Robin. Let's see what Demetrius thinks. 
Mayor Lewis. That one was cute, because Robin's always, like, working on things and, like, the whole tomboy thing, I guess. Oh. My goodness. <laughs> Did his mustache get bigger? Abigail's I'm interested in. Is she gonna go like frilly? Like Robin did? Excuse me? <laughs> what in the world? Oh, it's because she wants to be like, she wants to go into the mines and that kind of thing. That makes sense. Clint, you're up. Me? me? Uh, okay, Emily, I'll do it. Now, this I'm interested in, because he's always in his work clothes. I guess so is Robin. Let's see. I mean, he's always, like, in his blacksmith apron. Oh, wow. Oh, she called him cute. I wonder if they're all going to stay in these clothes. Do I get to do it? Well, that went very well. I just hope this experience helps everyone break out of their shells a bit. Do I not get to do it? Lock? Um, I couldn't do it. I don't want to break out of my shell. <laughs> I think Emily was going to say she was having a crush on us because this is like the eight heart event, I think. Um, and then Clint walked in. I guess I'm interrupting something here, aren't I? Oh, poor guy. I understand. I'll leave now. Congrats, Locke. No. I'm married. <laughs> nope. Not at all what that means. All right. Well, that was something. It was actually really cool to see everybody kind of express themselves. Um, Abby took me by surprise, but then thinking about how she wants to be... Um, like an adventurer and going to the mines and that kind of thing. It all makes a lot of sense, honestly. I keep saying I'm going to do things, and I end up doing other things. So I went and got the crab pots from the beach, and I'm going to drop them in here because we need two more fish that are... Spe I don't know what word I was about to say. I was looking for specifically. I don't know what was about to come out of my mouth, but it wasn't specifically. Freshwater. So we need to bait these and get these going so that we can get snails and one other one that I can't think of off the top of my head. All right, now let's do some things. All right, I just have a bunch of things in my hand right now. The hopper I could do. I do have one radioactive bar. So I don't know if I want to do that right now. I know that there's other things that are going to take the radioactive bar. Oh, let's just do it. I'm also short on hardwood, of all things. Really hard to come by. I also don't plant a lot of mahogany trees. I think mahogany is what gives you hardwood. And I also have stopped going to the secret foresty area. Okay, let's see. I don't have to go outside technically to do any of this. So we'll go hopper. We're going to go right in order. There we go. Crafted one of those. We go glowstone ring. Crafted one of those. Thorn ring. Crafted one of those. Bone mill, one of those. We are done with this page for now. There's going to be more recipes, I imagine. Geode crusher, we already got one. Ostrich incubator, we already got one. Stone chest, good. Farm computer, we got one. Mini obelisk, got one of those. Monster musk, got one of those. Uh, oh, I'm out of iron bars now. Okay. Wood lamp post, one of those. And campfire. Oop, I have too many things in my inventory. Went and tossed the rings in the in the dresser. So I think we still need the campfire. Stone brazier needs coal. I didn't grab any coal. We're making some moves. That's like like close to 10, maybe? Just right there in that little stint. I'm gonna throw some iron in the in the uh uh, uh furnaces. <laughs> I think they're called furnaces. Okay. Stone brazier? Whatever that is. Wicked statue. Uh, oh, now we got too many things in our hand again. <laughs> oh, man, I'm so good at this. There's just going to be a bunch of random things littered around here for a little bit. Oh, I like that. I don't know where I'm going to put the other obelisk. 
But that's good there for now. We can put our lamppost right there. I feel like our campfire can go maybe down here by Bullseye. Give him some something warm to, to sit by. Cute. We are quickly running out of time in this day. You can make iron out of copper? What? Yeah, I think I stopped here. So we got the wooden brazier as well. We got the wicked statue. Quality bobber. Let's do it. Um, what else can we do? I haven't done fiber seeds. Now I have. And campfire kit. One of those. I believe I've done most of the floors. That one's really easy to do. Refined quartz. We've done that one now. Treasure hunter. Crafted a bobber. Trap bobber. We'll do that. I'm once again out of space. I think that's good. We can call it there for today. We'll head to bed, see if there's anything else that we get in the mail. Maybe we go check out Quee, see what Quee's got going on. Okie dokie. I don't think we have a whole lot of fish we can catch in the winter time. I think we might have caught them all. I had the list pulled up and I couldn't really find anything. There is no shot that I just immediately caught a snail. <laughs> oh, I love it. Perfect. Can I set him free? I want to set him free. Just let him go. He is a cool little snail dude. I have so many things in my hand. I have so many unnecessary things now. Okay, so after the snail, and I guess the crawfish. Did I have a crawfish already? Did I not pick up the crawfish? Nope, did not pick up the crawfish. Hello? <laughs> I picked up the pot, but not the fish. Um, gonna rebait those just before I forget. With the crawfish and the snail. There we go. One there. One there. We need whatever this is. This is also from the crab pot in fresh water. Um, some of the legendary fish are on here. And I think a lot of these I just can't catch in the winter time. So we might be fished out for the winter. Alright, we got our iron bars. So we can go back and get the iron lamp post. Apparently I haven't made a crab pot. So we're gonna do that. And there's a lot of fishing things that I haven't made yet. Ooh, that one's pretty easy. See, I'm stuck between trying to make sure I do everything and just doing what I'm able to right now. So I think I'm just going to do that. So we got a warp totem. I haven't made explosive ammo yet, so we'll do that. I haven't made pure gold yet, apparently, so we'll do that. Slime incubator? Sure. We made lots of fertilizer. I haven't made this retaining soil. I am now out of things. Or placements. I uh, Inventory slots. I haven't made any retaining soil. All right, so we'll get those and then just toss it because I just need to craft it. Great. I need iron bars again for the mini jukebox. We've crafted those. I need copper ore for the drum block. We can do that. And drum block. Nice. Let's see. I think we're doing pretty dang good if I do say so myself. I need pine tar and maple syrup for these things. I need a gold bar. Oh, we have lots of seed makers. Uh, I haven't made any signs, apparently. I don't know how to use it. Oh, like that. I don't need a sign for bait. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, it doesn't steal my thing, though. So I can just turn into whatever I want. Do I have any wine in here that's ready? No. Beer sign. <laughs> so dumb. Is there anything else... Wood sign? Great. Like I said, I haven't made any signs. So, I don't really know. I don't know what to do with these. I guess I can put it next to my other my other sign. Double beer sign, I guess. I, I don't know. This is becoming very chaotic. We'll make another cask. I'll just go drop it into the basement. Hardwood fence? Sure, why not? We have done a lot of things. And it's only 10.30 in the morning. I just got a refined quartz out of the recycling machine, um, which means... Where is it at? There's a crystal floor. Crystal floor. Even more things. Just returning all of my things back to where I normally keep them. I think I've done as much as I can for now. 
We're gonna go need to get. We're gonna go need. We're gonna need to go. We're gonna. <laughs> I can't talk. We need to go gather more things, mainly like mob drops. Like I need more solar essence. That's the main one. I need mainly more solar essence. So we gotta go kill some ghosts, I believe. I want to go to Mr. Queez and see where we stand with the whole perfection thing. Since we just got all those crafting things and we got the more fish and I just want to see where we're at. I'm basically just counting every single percentage at this point. <laughs> I guess we could also expand like our strawberry farm over here. I can bring back strawberries and seed make and seed make new seeds and things like that. Cause we probably should be making more money than we are. 40% the big 4-0. We're getting there. 80% fish caught. That's pretty good. 60% crafting recipe. That's a huge jump. I don't remember what we were at, but way higher now. Cooking recipes, 20%. Great friends, up to 17%. Which, I think, a, like, a couple episodes ago, we were in single digits. So we're killing that. Produce and forage shipped. I feel like that's going to be a little tough. But isn't there something in here that shows me... Yes, it's all of this stuff. So we are still missing some things. And I might have to look them up. Wow. Do we have to ship all this? Items shipped. Farm and forage. Ugh. This is a lot more than I was thinking it was gonna be. Uh, okay, that's gonna that's gonna take some time. <laughs> I am going to need to look into this. Um, that looks like an iridium ore. I don't know on a lot of this other stuff. It's gonna take a lot of googling on a lot of this other stuff. And then it's still these things. I definitely can't do that in three days. I mean, I definitely can't do that in ten days. So I'm gonna come back in a couple days and check out what the next quest is just so we can get a better jump on it and just so you guys have an idea of what we're looking for we're doing the recipes so i want to get as many of the recipes as possible so that we have all of the things listed and i can go through and pick which ones we need to do all that good stuff after that we are looking at the galaxy souls to upgrade our weapon uh because i took a break i don't know where this episode is at so I might waste this day and sleep so that I can save and then end this episode. This part of the recording is already at an hour, and I think I recorded the first half of this for an hour as well, so I don't want this to become overwhelming for me later, so I can make sure I get it out for you guys. So we're going to take a nap in here, go to sleep very, very early, but get that save in. Wait for it. Wait for it. Bottom left corner. Saving game. Game saved. Please. Saving. There we go. <laughs> uh, yeah. So I hope there wasn't anything important. I doubt it. Yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thanks for being patient with me. I just have a lot going on and I will hopefully get back to my normal schedule in the next couple weeks. Um, I'm working on it. We'll see. I want to be better for you guys and I like playing Stardew. It's just that episodes take two hours to record. They take like five to edit. And then you got your posting and your thumbnail and all that good stuff. So thanks for working with me. Thanks for still watching. Thanks for being around. Like, comment, subscribe, do all those fun things for me. And as always, I'll see you in the next one.